today we're going to go see some sakura at Daigoji Simple. Yeah, it's like blooming everywhere all of the sudden. So we're gonna go see some. We're going to catch a bus somewhere in our neighborhood. We're just walking by. Hey, there's the main road. Ah, cool. Yeah, when I catch a bus, I'm out of breath already. The bus was here, so we were on our way to Daigochi Temple, which is a place that we've actually been to last year in autumn. And we went to go see the leaves and all of that stuff. So suddenly all the cherry blossoms were in bloom. So we went to go see the cherry blossoms, which is something that we've never seen before until coming to Japan, basically. So yeah, also enjoyed the bus ride because we got to see more of the neighborhood because we never really walk in this direction because we take trains from our house to where we work. So this was really, really cool to see neighborhood and what it looks like and just like taking it all in but yeah um in daigochi temple we got there like a bit earlier than the opening time of the temple just to try and beat the crowds but everyone else had the same idea basically and there's so many people there already but it wasn't as much people as you would see a bit later in this video so yeah but everything was so pretty like this weeping cherry blossom thing was so so nice and i didn't expect it to look this pink i was like wow this is really really pink so i took so many pictures in each and every cherry blossom i saw <laughs> because I was like i'm gonna get as many pictures as i possibly can because we blinked and all the cherry blossoms were in bloom and it was just insane to see so yeah temple look at that all the cherry blossoms oh yeah we came here in autumn then. Yeah. Oh, that dog is so aggressive yeah. Temple has not even opened yet. It opens at nine. It's eight forty-one. And look at the the people. This is okay. Ooh, look at that one. That one is huge. came here last year we had the option to buy one ticket to see one part of the temple so this time around they actually refused to sell us a type of ticket they sold us like a ticket to go into all three places which was okay we got that and our first plan was to go over this bridge take some pictures take some videos because it was really really pretty but unfortunately most of the cherry blossoms were not on the trees anymore it was just gone um, because most cherry blossoms actually like bloomed inconsistently so some were fully bloomed and some were already bloomed last week or something 
which I think we missed but it was still cool to like see what the place looked like in this season specifically but yeah we walked around a lot here and we took the same pathway we did the last time when it was autumn I'll insert a clip here so you guys can see what it, that looked like but it was really really cool to just walk through and take in the greenness of this garden because it wasn't this green the last time it was more like orangish or something but yeah it was really really cool to just like walk through and Diabalt was like experimenting with my phone and taking all these crazy videos for whatever reason so here is what he filmed <laughs> viewing it is super fun that's my review it's pretty it's a yeah it's very full of more temples to go to three more we are finished with this one so many cherry blossoms wow. like three more temples it's three different places of the same thing well oh, yeah This garden was so beautiful and if you look closely in the water you can actually see some koi fish which is really really cool to see I had to use my super zoom lens to show you guys where I spotted one koi fish but like there was a couple of in there so it was really really cool to see and also I don't even know how people actually entered in here but we were so tired of walking by this time we're like we're not going inside here and taking off our shoes to go see the garden from a different perspective but it was okay to see it from where we were because we had one more place to go to and we wanted to save our energy for that so we just stood here watched this and then we were on to the last place so this hall was not open the last time we came here in oh, when was it october yeah in october um it was closed off so we couldn't really see what was inside apparently it was getting repaired so now it was fully functional and it was open but we weren't allowed to take videos or pictures inside. This is us relaxing. This is the view. So we just walked around, looked at the Japanese history and all of that. And then afterwards, we went to go see some more cherry blossoms and then we made our way home.